Oh, hey, it's your pal Seth from Golf to Magazine. Here to tell you that the August issue is out now. I hope you'll check it out. It's our Herb Graffis Business Person of the Year issue. I want to say congratulations to Chris Navin. He is the superintendent at the club at PB Dye in Maryland. Uh, his story is an interesting one. I hope you'll check it out. He is a former school teacher turned superintendent. His first superintendent job is what uh, many called a turnaround project. The course has fallen into disrepair, uh, but now in 2023, earlier this season, it actually hosted its first U.S. Open qualifier. So the course has really come, come around. So congratulations to Chris. We got lots of more great content in the new issue, including uh, our annual uh, snow mold uh, trials recap from Paul Koch. We also have an article about how a superintendent rebounded from a bad ABW outbreak. We also have a column from Matt Schaefer, who just writes about how to survive summer stress. It's August, there's a lot of stress, we know. So Schaefer has some good advice on that. And then we have a section, new section in the magazine where we call back to the origins of the magazine. It's called the Business Journal. And we just asked some of our uh, partners in the industry to give us some savvy business advice. So you can check that out there. Also, our 19th hole this month is with Steve Leach. He is a superintendent of two courses in the St. Louis area. He tells us his best advice, and he also tells the story of the day the Stanley Cup happened to come out to his office. So new issues out now. I hope you check it out. Guys, it's almost September. Hang in there. Appreciate you all, all you readers of Golf Magazine. I'll see you out there on the golf course.